what is up, Hunt Hunter Nation, I'm your host, Murder Mash. Let's get right into the news! Hunter Hunter is coming back. Or is it? Before we get into it guys, make sure you're subscribed with those notifications on because you don't want to be out of the loop for news about the best shonen series that begins with H. Our first and only story is the hottest news on anime Twitter right now. Voice actresses Megami Han and Maria Issei both tweeted that they were having a cheeky recording session together the other day. Why is this so significant? Well, they voiced Gon and Killua in the 2011 Hunter Hunter adaptation. And it is common practice for all voice actors in a scene to record together. Let's take a closer look at what Megami wrote. I met my buddy. She also tweeted lol. Yes, it was recording of that work. I think we can inform you soon. My origin. What a whopping fat hint. Megami Han's first role, her origin, was in fact voicing Gon in Hunter x Hunter. Maria also dropped a hint in the form of a pixelated image. The colour scheme does look quite similar to Gon and his golden nen alongside Killua. However, it's really hard to make out. Well, that was the intention, wasn't it? So what could this mean? Spoiler warning, since Killua doesn't appear in the manga after Gon and Killua split up, this is likely not a continuation of the 2011 anime. So could this signify a new Hunter x Hunter reboot? The timing would be perfect as the prior two decades both had a run of Hunter x Hunter anime right at their start. However, it's practically unheard of for an anime to receive a third adaptation, though Hunter x Hunter is iconic enough to break the mould even further and receive one. If this is the case, then there is hope for the manga to come off hiatus and wrap up the story before the new reboot series can run out of material. After all, the Dark Continent arc has been hyped for nearly 10 freaking years. It's about time we see Preston and Jing's sexual tension animated. So option two, it's a movie. We've already had two, so a third isn't impossible. After all, anime movies are becoming quite popular now and they don't require the commitment of a full season to produce. A movie would also leave room for Killua to feature and could possibly spell the return of the manga. This is because a movie would massively help promote the manga and vice versa. Okay, there's a third option driven by our third clue. Megami's next tweet after quote tweeting Maria's tweet was, it's not what everyone sees, it's what everyone does. Everyone, everyone. So perhaps it's not an animation to watch, but a game to play? There have been both digital and live action Hunter Hunter games in the past, and basically everyone plays some type of game, right? Or maybe it's something more universal, like voicing for a digital assistant to help pay your taxes. Or maybe since everyone eats food, they are voicing for an interactive Hunter Hunter cafe. Or maybe this was just a philosophical tweet not related to anime at all. Perhaps the most realistic, yet most disappointing theory we can make is that they're not even recording for Hunter Hunter. They're pretty prominent voice actresses in the industry after all, with plenty more roles they can fill. I saw so many people's hopes get raised that this would definitely cause mass devastation. Make sure you have a stash of chocolates and tissues ready just in case this scenario turns out to be true. However, it's better to be pleasantly surprised than totally gutted, so take my recommendation and only be cautiously optimistic about what these tweets can mean. After all, we're inferring a lot from very little information, and as Megami and Rhea said, they'll be able to tell us more soon, so stay tuned. That is it for the news day guys, if you enjoyed the video, take the time to smash the like button and make sure you're subscribed because you guys know, as soon as I get the scoop, you'll be in the loop. Drama Mash, out. Now go.